any of you read books or are into you know self-help and some of that stuff i read a book from michael mayer called the seven levels of communication it's about a struggling realtor who isn't doing well gets a coach the coach gives him homework and he starts doing it and his business turns around and he becomes better right he starts his business blows up my dad is a realtor in california my dad was struggling i said dad i'm going to send you this book we're going to go chapter by chapter and then I'm going to give you, I didn't tell him this part until later. I was like, I'm going to give you the homework that the coach is giving the realtor in the book. He's like, uh, okay, whatever, you know, he was in that funky space. We did it. I said, hey, you got to pick your number, write down your goal. What is it? He said, I want to do 13. I said, okay, fine, cool. We went through it chapter after chapter. He did some, didn't do others. I was calling him out on it. I said, okay, so tell me exactly how many people did you call? Did you write the handwritten notes, whatever? So... I had finished the book. My dad hit his goal. Woo, great. I posted it on LinkedIn, right? And I, and I did a little video and I said, I'm gonna give this book away. Who wants it? And I give a little blurb about the book and said the author was awesome for writing a book like this. But what did I do? I not only educated in this post, maybe I entertained you a little because I'm in my car and I'm, and I'm doing a little thing here with a video. And then I'm also elevating my dad and the author. That's the money post right there. It incorporates all three, right? Not all your posts are gonna have that. When you are elevating others, you'd be surprised how much more love your posts get. Mm -hmm. Because it's not about you, right? Correct. Give more than you take. The cool thing that ended up happening is, I don't know if you could see the views, 2,500, 60 views. Yeah, whatever, I said ignore the noise, right? Mm -hmm. It's not really about that because it, you're posting over time. The cool thing that happened was, I've done this with several other, other books now, because we all read books, and then we're like, okay, I'm gonna put them here, because I'm gonna come back to it. You don't come back to it, right? Take all your notes. Some of us may go back and reread a book, but it's very rare. I mean, it's rare for some people, they get books, and you haven't even opened some books yet, right? So I was like, you know what? I'm, have, I'm running out of space, I need to do something. So I figured, I thought, why don't I do this? Why don't I do a post? I'll tag the author. So almost every book I read, almost everybody that I meet, I try to connect with you on LinkedIn. And I encourage you to do the same. So I found Michael Mayer on LinkedIn, made this post, and then check this out. Michael Mayer pops in. And he, and he commented. And he liked, which is awesome, because his entire network now sees my post. The power of that is incredible, because he has way more people than I do.